you know, every now and then we might see on the news people, oh, why to spend so much, so much work and so much money into the space? We have people starving here and on Earth and blah blah. Well, what you just mentioned about materials, I just can see like a direct application in day by day work. So having stronger materials, you can have stronger turbines. If you have cheap to manufacture turbines, it means electricity. It's pretty much cheaper to everyone and we know electricity per capita is based like an equivalent of like quality of life. So that's yeah. a very direct application that starts with something very, very high level, but yeah. very, very soon it's going to be into our day, day by day lives and people don't even realize it. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you know, the iPhone, the screen technology of the iPhone exists because of a, you know, a government funded program, uh, you know, and I didn't so know that. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, NASA technologies from the 60s, uh, you know, were driven, uh, have drove the entire electronics age that we, we take for granted, right? Was, yeah, yeah. You know, so, same is true. Yeah, materials, process, um, you know, I mean, a lot of people, the space industry in, in general is really, you know, focused on doing things like providing internet for total global global coverage. You know, mm -hmm. 40%, 40 of the globe doesn't have internet. You yeah. and I take it for granted, but you know, several billion people, their quality of life could be improved. It's it's tough to draw a line between the two, but yeah, you're absolutely it's right. No, you're absolutely right. And, yeah. and, and, and it's not like this is gonna decrease no quite the opposite it's not like we want this to be a privilege no we want that to be in the normal everybody right. to have access easily and electricity easily basically have a like a, a reasonable quality of life and that's we where well, we have almost 8 billion people now so we we got to provide that for all of that people and that just the exactly yeah. i love i love how we're tying turbo machinery into the global health uh you know really yeah <laughs>